Yeah, we interrupt our regularly scheduled programming uh, to, to, to bring you LeVar Ball with Stephen A. Listen, <laughs> this man was about to leave the building, but he saw me, decided he wanted to interrupt the sports center proceedings to make a point. Excuse me, you had some explaining to do. Three points on one for six shooting for the man who happens to be your son. He's got a lot of promise, but yeah. tonight was not a great night. You said it was going to be a great opening night. It was a great opening night. What? How? Big Explain. Big brand went up. 12%. Oh. It's always good. Even when you lose, I win. You see what I'm saying? Big ball of brand, we're here to stay. But I got I tell you. you what, Lonzo did good. How? How? What, what you game mean? were you watching? How did he do good tonight? Watching. Well, how did he do good tonight? Explain that, Mr. Rebounds. Coach. Rebounds. Really? Physical. Really? On a bad foot. Did you not say, oh, there's a bad foot now? That's where we going? I didn't, I, that's where we going? We going? Listen, don't Listen, start. Don't you start. Did you ain't move what was on? That? What was that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Listen, Patrick Beverly. Patrick hey, Beverly hey. got all over your son. He got all over your son. What did Patrick Beverly have? What did he have? Why you going on? Don't matter what he had. Here's what it is. Lonzo's not a one-on-one guy. But we're a team winner. And this is what I told him. Every 20 games go 15 and 5. We good. We only got one loss. Guess what? We tied with Golden State right now. Didn't they lose the first opening? Don't give me that. Up there with them. Don't give me that. One, one for six hey, shooting, three six. points. I'm not, I'm not trying you know to condemn him, but I'm just saying you he said, you said it was going to be bigger. What's in the kitchen cabinet? He got to find out what's in there. You got to see what's going on. The times he was out, you seen him with no direction. When he get back in there, Neil, help me when I'm wrong now. <laughs> when he was in there, it's very positive. Let's break it down. One for six, it ain't about shooting. It's about rebounding, assists, catching the ball, running the lane. Somebody got to run down the middle of that floor. Don't make me bring my shoes out and run. I can get 20 points running down the middle. So let me get this straight. What you're saying is yes. your son, yes. your son really didn't have a bad game. It's just that everybody he around him had a struggle. And because of that, you, that's why he didn't look as good. Is that what you're saying? About everybody? That's I'm asking you. I'm asking a question. Oh, no, no, don't worry about it. I'm asking. I'm asking. I'm asking a question. I'm asking a question. Hey, I'm asking a question. That's all I'm saying. saying. They're going to learn to play with him, and then the winning going to go sky high. Trust me. It ain't nothing but a little teaser. I did the same thing to y'all in Vegas. Lose a couple of games, Lonzo's a bust. Then he come back and win MVP. It ain't that hard for my son. He don't lose a lot in a row. How do you do it? How do you <laughs> sit here and come up with a positive explanation a positive after explanation. a game like this? How do you do it? How? How do you think my boy's got to be so great? Oh, Lord. Bad games, it's only a bad commercial. Do you not accept some culpability for the fact that you have made, you have put a bullseye on your son, whether it's Patrick Beverly tonight or anybody else any other hey. night? Everybody Tell wants a me. piece of your okay, son okay. because of if, you. If I didn't say anything, do you think they're going to come at him still? Would they be as motivated? Hey, I want them motivated to the fullest. We love the competition. We don't hide from nobody. I want to be crazy and say, come after my son. You think he's going to just sit there and let you well off on him? You no. got that part he's down. coming back. But see, here's the thing. This is what Lonzo understands. When he do good, everybody can be with you. When you do bad, they'll jump off the bandwagon. But you look to the side of you, man, your daddy going to be there all the time, whether you do good or bad. Because well, it's that... all good to me. He only want to impress me and himself. He don't worry about that all the fans. Let us finish out the season. Then we say, one game, that don't do nothing. Uh. I knocked out a dude one time to get back up. Here's my you issue. Don't fight that kill. Here's my issue, excuse me, Neil. Here's my issue with what I saw from Lonzo. Lack of aggression. I wanted him to make things happen for the other guys right. because I think that they're right. ill-equipped to make right. those opportunities for themselves. Right. I didn't see that right. from Lonzo tonight. How right. do you explain that? You're not going to see that because that's your game. That's why nobody wants to play with you. See, everybody wants to play with Lonzo. Lonzo let them people get the feel for the game. See he what's buckled going on. his knees. Yes. He See, buckled Stephen A's knees. You just want to be aggressive, take over the game. That's why you were standing over here, man. I wouldn't want to play with you. Because when things go bad, you want to take all the shots. Guess what? We're going to lose anyway. But at least when he loses, Lonzo see what he got. He let the guy say, you know, we lose. I believe in you still. I don't care. We're going to get it. You know what? He beat me tonight. I, I can't deal with you. Yeah. I can't do it. One for six performance, three points in his debut, six? and you sit up here and sound like he dropped 40. Okay, I did. Okay, Only okay. you would do this. I can't do it. I can't do it with I'll you. I'll tell you what. Uh, one for six is better than what he did in the preseason. I'd rather have Lonzo go one for six in play than go 0 for 0 and sit on the sideline. All right. Playing opening night. Lakers, go, away, Lakers go 0 for 1. You, you're, you appear to be undefeated. You're 1 and 0. 1 and 0. 1 and 0. Goodbye, man. We'll be back over Goodbye, here. We're going to send it back to Stan. Goodbye, Stan. Goodbye, Goodbye LeBron. Back. Back. Goodbye. Pat Beverly is going to be here. Let's go. Blake Griffin. Blake's coming. Block A. Tell Patrick we're going to see him when he got a home game here. All righty. Keep the stats now. All right. Stay in your lane.